yeah, it says now we're live. Yeah. Good day, Crafty Chums. It's Nikki and Eileen here coming at you with some mixed media art dolls or something like that. Whatever we come up with is what it's going to be. It's supposed to be like, I thought it was supposed to be like outfits for our dress form or something. Yep, yep like that. that's it. Yep. Dress form art dolls, whatever you like to call them. <laughs> that's what we're doing. I never know what it's supposed to be called. Oh, Let's just see if anybody's going to show up. <laughs> There's um, no no heads, nothing. Here's dark body. Uh, speaking here. <laughs> oh yeah. Did you did you shape the back too? I tried my yeah. best to get yeah. it to be. It was not. It was get. I only had one grain of sandpaper to work with, so it was a little frustrating. I couldn't get it perfect. Yeah. So that's hence why it's so rough. And then I painted mm. over the rough, glued over the rough, painted over rough. So it actually looks like a chunk of wood, really. It's so yeah. rough. But I mean, it's good for. It's going to get covered anyway. Yeah. So. I like it. Yeah, it's going to be okay. I'm going to leave my stick long for now so that it'll be hopefully easier to work with. So yep. that I can hold it, I'm thinking. I made a little disc out of, um, I was thinking about using CD, but I'm making a little disc. Yeah. I'm thinking this is, this is going to be easier and then I'm going to be using a, a, a whatever, a um, skewer, I think, bamboo skewer. I think it is, and mine will stand up on the bamboo scooter with a uh, little doll head thing because it's got yeah. a hole in already. So I was going to use a cork, but um, then I thought, no, let's let's keep it easy. <laughs> you know me, I'm all for the easy. <laughs> so don't make it any more complicated than I have to. So I've left it like that. I'm going to cover this with um, some paper. I'm going to do the base first and then because I'm still thinking about what I'm going to do with my little dress form. So, uh, yeah, what style I want. I'm sort of like almost there, but, um, yeah. <laughs> to just make, looking at, to make, just looking at this, yeah, sorry. Oh, no, it's okay. To make my dress form, I had caught, I traced a picture of a dress form on my phone. This is the size that I got it on my phone, and I just penciled over it. And then I glued it onto my styrofoam. And that's how I got the shape for mine. And then I just carved it and then sanded it. Nice. Cute. Yeah. So that's why I have these cut out. I, I, I'll i save that because the, the glue was, was really bad glue I bought, uh, I bought, I guess, from Dollar Store. Anyways, hopefully yeah. I do an outfit for it <laughs> i have myself boxes cardboard boxes for my outfit cool and my did my thing i'm going to save for last to make i mean because i'm going to glue it in last and then work around it i think yeah 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 That's Sorry to interrupt. I was just like, oh. no, no, no. I was bab babbling on. <laughs> just like, I was talking about nothing. <laughs> just doing the babble. Uh, and hopefully, I can make some. I want to make armor. So I'm hoping I'll be able to make something. But yeah, all, the armor, mm. all, sorry, all the armor they have for girls really suck. I mean, they don't protect them. They're half naked. <laughs> my guys pulled it up it was terrible obviously armor not made by women no. 
no women armorers back in the day. Yeah. Well, I guess they did for the the, the maiden. The, um, Queen. No, yeah. Well, yeah, I guess they'll do, but the uh -huh. uh, a little bit of kind of armor stuff uh, was made for not maybe not by it would have been leather armor more more, but um, in the Vikings, the women the women did fight. There were women Vikings as well. Yeah. Would would be wool and leather, wouldn't it? It probably would be. Although they did have metal, but mostly, I think they would have saved that for weapons. Yeah. I don't remember both Sia fighting in armor. <laughs> mm. So, sort of thing they used to make for women were um, chastity belts and um, yeah. metal golds. <laughs> if they had a nagging, nagging woman or something, they'd put these little metal contraptions on their mouth, you know, in their mouths and around their heads to stop mm. them talking. <laughs> Oh, lovely. Yeah. How, how lovely men were to women back in the day. <laughs> I'm going to have a busy bottom, maybe. I'm too busy. Mm. Yeah, I think that paper. We are, are, aren't we? Hmm? We still are on our own, aren't we? Yes, we are, yep. We can just craft and play. <laughs> Ooh, okay. I think we can go mad. gone to my fire off because it's actually quite warm today. Mm -hmm. I'm just turning my fire off. Michelle, hi, Thalia. Fine. And Mary. And Mary. We have some visitors. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Mary. We're um, making mixed media body forms. And uh, if you can see what Eileen's doing, she's actually making armor for hers. And um, hi, Fiona. And I don't know what I'm making on mine yet. <laughs> I'm going to decide a little bit in a little bit. That's why I'm starting with bases because I don't have an idea yet. Yeah, so I made my form out of... Um styrofoam kind insulation and I just cut out a piece I traced my cell phone I don't have a printer so I traced it off my cell phone off the dress form glued it on cut it out and then just carved it to this and um, now I'm just trying to make some armor um, so I made a pattern here kind of figure out doing some kind of armor for her. So I'm using um, recycled cardboard to do the armor. And that's what I'm doing. 
Yeah, and my body form's made out of my usual book paper. So uh, quite easy, quite easy to do. Over the easier option. <laughs> so it's over, yeah, the, over the doll, it's paper machine. Yeah, just the easier it. way to do it. <laughs> I would have done it that way, but do you know how many days it takes to dry? <laughs> yep. So I'm like, eh. Not today. Not today. No. Oh, so I've got no pin handy to unglue the thing. Let's do work. So, oh my god, I think I'm going to have to cut out pieces in my armor to make it fit her a bit better. This is like a design in trial kind of a thing. I don't know what I'm doing. Trial and error, that's the one word I'm looking for. Just, you know, it's just trying kind of thing. I can't squeeze this screw hat. <laughs> Hi, Sherry. Much too hard. So I think if I did this way and did it under. Maybe Hi, way. Sherry. Okay, so if I do it the same on the board work. Hopefully this all works out. <laughs> yeah, I loved your, your uh, shield tag. It was awesome. Thank you. It Some of them, when inspiration comes, it, it's easy, but when it doesn't, it's hard. they're difficult. <laughs> But uh, you're right, I'm getting tagged out. <laughs> tagged out, yeah. Tagged Only out. a couple more days to go. Yep. <sighs> All right. I think maybe in future we'll do the week ones rather than 30 day ones. <laughs> okay. okay. Let me glue this on. I think, I think I have to add. I think I have to add. Triangles in her, her waist area, I think. Maybe hug her body. A bit more. So I think. I mean, add, cut out, I mean, a piece there. This is winging it, totally winging it. Can you guys see anything I'm doing, or do I need to try to magnify it? I could try zoom in, but usually, sometimes my zoom is very blurry. That's the problem. I think I'll give it a try here. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's going to be. glued on and stuff. And it doesn't even have to be this long. Ah, that looks not bad, eh? First no. Okay. We'll try that. Okay. 
We will try that. She's just the shape of a. Uh, <laughs> Um, hi, Mary. Yeah, that's double-sided tape would be good, too. She's just the shape that just kind of came out of my head that it worked with the size of um, foam that I had. And maybe a little too thin, but whatever. I didn't want to struggle too much with, like, This is the size of the foam I had. So by the time I got it kind of all rounded where I needed it to be, that's kind of where it worked for the thin house, her body shape, I think. There's her armor. Hi, Crafty Spirit. Hmm. How are you? <laughs> Who? Crafty spirit. I have. Oh, did I miss somebody? Oh, sorry. Hi. <laughs> Hi, crafty spirit. I'm like. And that's kind of cute because she's got, I think, an owl. And I went, who? Hoot. Hoot, hoot. Anyways, there's her bottom part of her. Kind of like the, what's that called? Nikki, that part that goes corset? No. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Looks uh, like a corset. corset. Yeah. Yeah. But. Body curse. Corset or bodice. <laughs> bodice, yeah. So anyways, that's going around there. Now, I need to, make the part that goes over here, over top, but this, I don't think I'll be able to do it with, with these. If I did, it would be just kind of sticking out like that. Um, trying to think as I go. <laughs> but I did make... Trying to get everything out of the way so I make sure I don't like... This is one of those things. Okay, so I have, I have my paper one here. Maybe if I did glue it over. Hmm. I still I could cut a piece off the edges or I could even add. All right, I'm going to try it. I'm going to cut triangle off the edge round it up a bit oh uh, men armor man's armor is so much easier to do yeah less curves. <laughs> yeah this is men down the shape to it no nope. there's like no shape mm. See if that works. Okay. Precision. Just think precision. <laughs> Still thinking. Thinking, thinking. Oh, sometimes it's hard. 
Yeah, I'm trying to make little cone shapes. What I'm thinking is I'm going to kind of make this rounded and then do a little bit of a cone shape on top. But it, I might not need it. We'll see. Sorry. I'm going to do the darts on the side, though, here. Can you see what I'm doing? It's just I'm using I'm totally using hot glue because I'm never going to have it dry if I use anything. So this is all experimental. Oh, and as I go, oops, hopefully I learned something from my next one. Okay. <laughs> I'm keeping all my pattern pieces as I make them because I don't want, if I like something, I want to have it. And if I need to fix something, at least I have my first piece, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, okay, let's try to do that again. I do have little cone things here in case to make over top if I don't like it. Like, but right now I'm gonna see if I can make it. It's so much easier if I were to use like a rubbery foam and do it like on a person rather than cardboard. <laughs> Because I'm like telling the Kendra, like, I want to make you a armor with foam, right? To make it look like real for cosplay. It'll be so yeah. fun. But on cardboard, something like this, this teeny, it's a little hard. So, yeah. Well, I had to watch a couple of cosplay um, videos to kind of figure out, oh, yeah, I need to make this, you know. So I haven't made anything yet, but for the this armor and stuff. But I kind of got my idea that, okay, I do have to make a dart. I wasn't sure I was gonna cut it right in this part, but I'm giving it a try. Cause I can, I have a pattern to cut another piece if it doesn't work. Oh, darn. Okay, I gotta glue that again. When Nikki's like, oh, I want to do this project. I'm like, you know, this is going to be a long stream. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Could be a long stream. Okay. Like, <laughs> Darn, maybe this one's not big enough. <sighs> You guys can see fingers, fingers and fingers. Hoping this isn't going to be a wrapping video. Yeah. Well, I'm still on this one side, so. I might have to throw in some glue for good measure on the inside. Hopefully it doesn't make it. Oh, that's hot glass. Hot, that's hot glue. Ah, oh, it makes it un. How many fingers can a person do this? Come on.
This is not working so well. Okay. The idea works ish. Yeah. I just need to get this one side cooperating with me. Mm -hmm. I need to attach this to something so it doesn't go through the hole. Oh, my God. No, I can see it. Just going to knot it onto there for a minute. I don't want it to go through the hole while I gather up all this netting. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, thank you, honey bear. Can you let your doggies out? Pardon me? You can talk, honey bear, yeah. <laughs> you are allowed to talk. Grandma, can I talk? Isn't that cute? Yeah. <laughs> That's poor, yeah. <laughs> Okay. So far, that took a long time. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm happy with that. I don't think I have to add cones on top. <laughs> Madonna cones. Yeah. Uh, oops, oh, let me hot dry one side, or I mean cool one side here, strap. I think I'm going to shake my body so that I'm going to do a little ballerina, I think. Oh, darn. I think he came undone again. My dart. Well, it's still got the shape because it's kind of been played with so much that it's kind of shaping that way anyway. Mm -hmm. So even if it comes undone, I'm going to try it one more time. Then I'm just going to leave it if it comes undone. It's getting glue everywhere. Yeah, these, um, I'm going to try to make them go way up against her chest. I... Okay. Hot. Very hot glue. Can't see me. Ooh, that's warm glue, boy. Yeah. It's a trouble when you have your glue gun on for a while, isn't it? Yeah. But you kind of got to hold it there, so. Mm. Whatever, I guess. You're right. Okay. Where'd I go? The light is not very good, huh? It's too bright or something. Okay. Not the best armor so far, but okay, let's see here. Uh, now that we have that, we probably want to give her a back piece, back plate. Let's see, back to the drawing board. 
for a back plate. Okay, we have the stomach, chest. Uh, we have to make a back plate. Ooh, I think I'll kind of use my design of the chest, bottom part of the chest plate, and where it comes out, and so I think. Something like that should be good enough for her back. Should be, in theory. Where's my... Here it is, my scissors. I was going to say, where's my scissors? What am I looking for? Cora? Yes. Cora, dog, please. No, I can't be barking. <sighs> Stinker dogs. Happy, come here. Okay, that might be too big, but that's why we have a guide. Cut in half, fold it in half. Okay, Michelle. Okay. Oh, okay. Back part of my arm. There we go. Yay. Breastplate almost done. And the back. <laughs> Moi. Happy. All right. And we'll put that aside, and then we'll save that for the future. Okay. Dog hit the door window with the bone a bit. <laughs> Bumped it. Hey, uh, loud dog. They were shaping that. To be. Doesn't have to be perfect, but. See how that works.
holding it with my pencil. That I'll stop it from killing my fingers. There we go. That works. Oh. Hi, Michelle, you're back. <laughs> Hi, Michelle. Big. <laughs> Michelle is back. <laughs> Better be back. Yes, he's back. Cutting the excess glue right now because I'm not sure how it's going to look after and I just as I'm thinking here I just may as well do it now <laughs> my back armor I'm not sure I might have to kind of play around with it but I got glued on anyway my back plate to protect oops Charge your phone. Oh, there we go. Not sure how I'm liking it right now. But... Maybe I'm being too picky. little slits and just so I'm putting a couple little slits in the back here just so it forms a little bit more like her back shape I don't want it just kind of sticking out So I have a little V cut here in the very back and then right under her, what would be her shoulder blade there, I'm putting just a little slit there. Not quite perfectly in the back against her, but that'll be okay. She'll probably have a cloak or something anyways. Cool. Oh boy. What else do we do?
coffee's cold. <laughs> Turn your net to refill it for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I have the part here. Now, I have her. I'm not going to do leg. I obviously left her with a skirty type of thing. I got to figure something like that out now. And I also have to do some kind of shoulder pads or something. Oh boy, let's see. Shoulder pads. Paper. Do shoulder pad. Got it. Make this through here. Just going to make a knot in here until I'm ready to uh, actually place it. It's an element. Sometimes you're going to make the elements first, don't you? Mm -hmm. so I'm yeah. doing this, and then I'm thinking I might like to turn her into a fairy, actually. Uh, rather than a ballerina, but hey. <laughs> Let's see. I'll think about this for a second. I think... My shoulder pad's gonna come over like this, something like this, something like that. Let's see. I'll cut two of them if I don't like the design. I you do it. Okay. Now one for one side. One for the other side. If I like these design. Michelle said fairy would be cool. Blue on my pen, pencil. All right. One. Wow. 
one, two. Let's see if this looks good. I think that will look good. So I'm, I'm going to draw them out on carbon now. I'm just gonna, this glue is really um, gorgeous anyway. I don't think it is here. So I can reuse my pattern up. that way. It's Shoulder pads or whatever armor. One side and the second. I'm just going to curl my arm in, or my shoulder pads in, so it goes on my How did I have that? I have it like that, and then I'm going to this. Okay. sat in the chair now. <laughs> Thanks, cat. Yeah. Shoulder armor. Thank you. Bye bye. Oh, who's going? Am I leaving? Yeah. It's leaving already. Right, okay. I'm just going to decide now. I could, of course, obviously do wire ones, but I did that the other day. So um, I'm going to do paper wings. So I'm just oh, going to see whether I want angel wings <laughs> or fairy wings. Nice. Butterfly wings or fairy wings. Those are amazing. Wow. Is that stencil? It's a die. Oh, that's nice. Wow. Yeah. So just go see which one I want. Mm -hmm. Well, 
Well, even if you did angel wings, you could still make it into a fairy. Very pretty. Yeah. yeah. They are, aren't they? They are very pretty, yeah. More, darling. Okay, we need. I did the shoulder. Maybe we need a kind of a. What's going on? Maybe we need a bit of a belt here or something. What can I do about the waist though? I'll have to put a belt underneath as well. So I'm gonna draw out a belt of some sort. I think. Can we see me doing this? Nope. <laughs> it is one of those things it's like I can't okay okay so we need to put I would like to put the If I like this, Folding in half so I can get kind of somewhat even on both sides. Cora, he would like a peanut butter and jam sandwich, please. Let's see if I like this. I kind of think I do. it on my belt this design
ice machine. <laughs> ice on the, on the floor. floor. Ice maker, whatever. It just pops out ice from the fridge. Oh, okay. No biggie. One pops into the freezer. My ice drops into the freezer. <laughs> well, it looks like this paper wants to stay on, so let's leave it on. Okay, so I'll try to go. belt he is cute to see yeah. mm. I kind of like that belt I'm higher I don't know if I'm making a belt too soon, but I kind of like it. I think I'll leave the back open for now, though, because I want to put the dress pieces, skirt pieces, which I'm not sure about. I have my design for my feathers for my thing. I was thinking of something kind of interesting like that where I'm making like I'm sorry, I'm going to grab my wing. Kind of interesting parts to her armor. I think that would be cool. A Valkyrie, huh? Pardon me? A Valkyrie. Yeah. So, but I want it in sections so then, yeah, she can use it in war and fighting or whatever. It doesn't all mm -hmm. whole piece. So, I'm going to make two of these. I'm just using my same pattern I used for my phoenix wings. I can't decide it right now. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. Okay, so I don't know how I can put to make down for a second and then it totally disappears. Um, pardon me, Vicky? I love how I put something down for a second and it totally disappears. <laughs> I understand that. All too well. Around that up a bit. Quite the options if I want it to go forward or backwards. The design of it is quite open. I like that. Sound for him? Good, good, good. Jackson Bear, eat it. Okay. So. Kind of like Do it the other way around. And it looks too dressy, you know. I don't like it this way. So. Oh, 
pull that against there. Okay. Do some more styles. Let's see. Back part of my armor dress thing, Mitchie here. So entertaining, are we? Probably <laughs> <laughs> not.
Okay, so this is one piece. I'm going to wrap it a bit around my pencil. All right. We'll just look it on her like that. I think so. Is it too long? Do I go higher up? Could go. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Perfect. I'm gonna save some of these cuts in case I need them for her arm or something. Michelle's still here, yay. Yeah. <laughs> she says, I'm still here. Oh, my screen went off again. Guys, is that Kendra watching Showman? Dad's watching Showman? I'm going to have a heart attack. Okay, because I mean, if Dad was watching it, I would like wonder what the heck he must have hit his head. <laughs> because he wouldn't appreciate it. It's too, for him, it's not fun. <laughs> I'd be like, what? Seriously? You're missing this? He's watching Showman? <laughs> He doesn't like singing in, in movies. I'm like, oh, it's so good. Yeah, it's called a musical. Yeah. He's <laughs> like, come on, they're the best. It's a musical. <laughs> what do you <Right>? expect? <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, I think Kendra's either watching it or listening to the music. Okay. Now I have the bottom part of my pieces here. Yay. Just to get and make sure I have this the way I want. I might have to glue a couple of these pieces in here too. Okay. Okay. I'll glue that one. Hmm. Either that or I'm just going to cut a strip. What am I going to do, Nikki? I don't know. <laughs> what, you, what you making there? Um, I just want to make sure the dress looks kind of, or whatever it's called, looks kind of um, even as sure. Oh, okay, yeah. or something. So I did a piece like this in the back. First, then did this and this. Mm 
I don't know why, but I feel like wrapping everything in tissue. <laughs> I, why. I just am. Mm. In the mood. Well, I just want to. I'm in the mood for wrapping everything in napkin. <laughs> okay, I'm going to do a different style. Okay. I'm going to put... Oh, I'm going to add a glue stick here. Put this one on. Strange magic. It's no, I haven't seen strange magic. Have I? No. Sorry, I'm not keeping track. Hmm. No, I haven't. No, I haven't even heard of it. <laughs> Obviously, it's about magic. <laughs> I was just gonna, I was just going to say, what's it about? <laughs> Okay. Here we go. That's how it's looking so far. It's a family movie. Nice. Family movies are always good. Well, my family is trying to get me to watch Tiger King. Oh, Sherry once watched it and she described it to me and I'm like, eh. <laughs> Apparently it's all the rage. It's all the rage. Did yeah. he do it? Did he do it? Did she murder her husband? <laughs> did he? Did he hire a hitman? Uh, and I'm resisting. <laughs> yeah, I have no urges to watch it. <laughs> My, eh, I don't know. <laughs> Chose my stomach. Um, people, yeah. people um, breeding wildlife to uh, so they can make money off it. You know, it's like no, you know, cubs and things like that, so they can make money off it. Yeah. So the um, strange magic. It's about fairies in a forest. And animation music with Alan Cumming. Music is brilliant, one of my favorites. Yeah, I've never even heard of it. No, me either. Hmm. I can't see this is I probably should have made it a little bit more. Oh, not the right style. I'm not really having a good go with this here. I think the back piece just the way it went. Oh, she also says it's very funny, well worth a watch. Hmm. Well, I'm just getting this one because I can't get the look that I want.
the sun oh yeah. let me scrap some out here Trying to figure this out as I go along here. I'm still playing with time. <laughs> I'm still thinking about it. <laughs> I'm making my front part here, I think. If I like it, I'll put it on. If I don't, I'll do another attempt. Mm -hmm.
I'm not sure how much more I want. Hmm. Maybe I should add more detail to the skirt before. Hmm. Thinking about it, I probably should have. Don't have very much detail. Well, my next one will have to have more detail. <laughs> I don't have very much detail on here. I'm like, ah. Oh. It's a start, though, of a design. Could be way more detailed. <laughs> I think that's not bad for my first one. Well, actually, yet. Could have had more detail. Yeah. Now thinking I could have, before I added these, I could have added like another layer or something. Yeah. But. I didn't think about that till after, but for like I said, for the first one, it's not bad. Nope. <laughs> Trying to give you an idea what can go on. I think. Hmm. Try to cut a few little holes in here. I should have done that before too. Right in the corners. Just things I didn't think about after, and then I'm like, oh, that looks neat. Yeah, I think I could add some more netting to mine, but we'll see in a minute. enough but maybe not I kind of like those little holes and I should add them before but I yeah. just add them yeah. you like that so next time i know because i added them up here on her skirt part kind of like that roman style or something i don't know where i've seen yeah, it yeah. so that's something i like for the future i don't think i'll be able to get in here to do any more nope I do like that, so I'm going to do that next time. It looks really cool. Thanks, Michelle. Oh, right. Oh, that's cool. Michelle's sister named her baby Tess. She just oh. had a baby. Oh, cute. Yep. She back home yet? She must be. Or did they? Uh, or are they keeping them in hospital for a long time? 
Okay, I definitely could see a lot of potential for a lot more detail in the future, future projects. Hmm. I do like it. Mm. Just going to add a bit more onto this. I think I just need a bit, bit more. Mm. A bit longer. Okay, so I'm, doing for now, I'm really happy. With oh no, I need to um, put it on the base, don't I? Hmm. work on the base then which I have right here which I put my other scissors <laughs> hacking away with my Tim Holt scissors and it's like we still have to wait not good yeah she's home can't wait with you yeah of course you have to wait yeah well you're not allowed to visit you're in isolation you see so you're not allowed to go visiting other people in their homes. You wouldn't want to visit a baby anyway, would you? Yeah. No. Okay, so. I think. Oh, it's a good thing I didn't cut my skewer to where I thought I wanted it because it would have been way too short. I think I'm going to leave it yeah. just as this it down here and it wouldn't have been way too short for her her outfit okay so i'm gonna cut another circle out i'll we'll get to the painting Hear the turtles constantly trashing around. Is that the same one it is, is it? Yeah, it's that one new one we rescued. Um, she's just not, she gets calmer now. She used to be really crazy, but she's just not sure what's going on yet. You know, things are different for yeah. her. So. She's not sure what's going on in her life, but she's happy. Now she's starting to come to us for food, which is good. She's just not sure about. The enclosure mm -hmm. stuff. So, what do you feed turtles? Um, they have turtle food, pellets and and stuff, but they also eat dried crustaceans and also shrimp, fresh shrimp, but like frozen or whatever. Um, yeah. And they eat some vegetarian stuff. But these guys only like to seem to eat carrots. They won't eat anything else too much because I don't know. The turtles live a long time and they were never introduced to anything. Mm -hmm. So it's a slow process. I finally got them eating carrots and uh, they eat cucumber. It was a it took a long time to get them to eat things. They eat some they eat some fish. Um, we get them little fish to catch, but they're still they still they get tired of that too, right? So they don't want to always do that. They have we have four fish alive in their little pond. <laughs> But um, this is looking good. They eat a variation like that. So they have turtle pellets. They eat like um, pellets that 
our koi pellets because I don't know what some of them were eating before, but I had to start feeding them koi food because they wouldn't eat turtle food. Mm -hmm. So I had now got to where I'm mixing half and half. Yeah. But um, I've had them for a while too, for about, the, this new one's just new, but I've had the other ones for, one of them for about seven or eight years and the other one for about six or something like that, seven years. So I think one I had a little bit longer, like a year or so longer. Wow. Good. I should probably even longer than that. Because we've been here almost six years, so it's probably been longer than that. But. And then the new one, um, she's the one that keeps trying to get get away right now. But she is happy. She's finally coming to us for food, which is good. Yeah. I was a little worried that she was going to be like a real pain. Okay, so now I'm going to paint it. I think, what do you think? Thank you. I think she's brought me a cup of tea. Yeah, paint it, yep. Yep, okay. I think for now, I mean, I, I'm now looking at it. I know where I can do more detail for next time. Yeah. Um, but yeah, um, it didn't take as long as I thought it was going to take. <laughs> I was like, oh, this is going to take a long time. Hey, guys, do you want some more food? Do you want some food to be quiet? Hey, turtles. Do you want some food? Do you want some food? <gasps> Did I see the magic words? Food. <laughs> Here, babies. They come running. Turtles, come here, babies. There's some food. Hi, Jill. Can you take the old carrots out, please? Yeah. Your hands and wash your hands. Yep. Thanks. They shouldn't be left in there too long. Then there's one more piece over there. Oh, they also like live mealworms and that kind of thing. Yeah. Huh? No, I'm not done lunching. I'm sorry, I'd give them some food so they're quieter. Okay. Now I'm gonna paint black first, and then I'm gonna go with um, hmm, metallics or something. Where's my black? Um, Chloe, I'm going to ask you to sweep the floor for me because I'm in a cardboard mess. Big, giant cardboard mess. <laughs> Thank you, sweet pea. You're so nice. You're so nice to me. Thank you. I thought it was the easiest thing to get on the floor for now. <sighs> Since we are on the lower floor. Hopefully, there's enough. Okay. Okay. I'm going to put this upside down. Let my hot glue go. Cool. I bought these really nice little bins. I'll have to show you guys at some point. They're from the dollar store. And they're super nice. Oh, I can't really show you on here. 
right now, but maybe at the end I can show you quickly. But they're like four dollars, and so far I bought four of them. And then I just put all my paints and everything in them. Maybe I can show you quickly. And then paintbrushes and all that kind of stuff. Four dollars for these nice, and they're really hard to pick bins. Oh well, yeah. Yeah, and I mean they charge like for a tray set at Michael's. They charge like fifty dollars for a. It's got wheels and everything, but you know it's just so expensive. I've been wanting one, but I can't really afford it. Yeah, yeah. yeah I can't really like just put the money towards that. And feel not guilty about it but then these can go on the shelf and i like that so i was pretty happy with these four dollar ones yes i spent sixteen dollars on four but i'm not all at once either right so i went back and got two more the other day yesterday i think sometimes they have the best stuff anyways I'll have to show you my other one holds my paintbrushes. I have a couple of glue guns in there. It's just like very handy. And it's just like those little things that you roll around. You know, you see people have all the time on, on videos. Uh, yeah, the rolling couch. Yeah. yeah, I mean, these are not rolly and they're just tra each one individual. But it's the same concept of holding your stuff. And I just put them on my shelf. So... For the price, you can't beat it. And then we had like a teal, like a kind of a, a robin's egg and a almost a robin's egg kind of color and this yellowy color, creamy yellow. And I like the creamy yellow for the kitchen area because it kind of looks clean, you know. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I bought a few of those. I really like them. Since I can't craft downstairs, I gotta kind of have a way to bring some stuff upstairs too. <laughs> but I really like them. Yeah, yeah they're kind of cool. I'm going to pull these forward a bit. I, should have, I guess I should have just painted my form black. It definitely could have so much more texture if I would have thought I had time instead of putting everything together so fast. But with the uh, butterfly wings because the angel wings were just too large for the dress. Mm. Well, this was quite fun. Yeah. I never done done this before, like with armor. <laughs> it's quite, it's quite a calming, isn't it? Yeah, I'm quite, I'm quite enjoying it. When you first said oh, I want to do this, I'm like, oh. <laughs> really? <laughs> God, Mickey <Vicky> never fails. <laughs> then I'm like, wait a minute, I could turn that into armor <laughs> or something cool. <laughs> yeah. so, something that interests you, yeah. Yeah. I've always been kind of tomboyish, I guess. I swear, when I was a little kid, I thought I was going to be some kind of warrior, cause watching, you know, like Bruce Lee or, <laughs> you know, 
with my dad <laughs> um, or all these, you know, Arnold Schwarzenegger, um, Rocky, you know, all these things. <laughs> Uh, don't know what I was thinking, but I was like, oh, yeah, I want to be like them. Yeah. Duh. Not thinking they were men and I'm a woman, right? <laughs> Obviously, Xena um, Warrior Princess wasn't there uh, at the time. Not at the time, Almost done. The first layer of paint here. Do I have enough paint? Do something with the back now because that's a bit ugly. Mm -hmm. So let's have a look. What about all I got? see is oh. acrylic. Acrylic. Can I say acrylic? Yeah, pretty spring. Getting there, getting there. Oh, I'm really liking that. Yeah. So much. <laughs> I can't wait to do one with layers, more layers on the cardboard. Yeah. Now that I did all this, I'm like, oh, I should have done that. Looking at it now, like, ah, oh, what was I thinking? I could have done like edging and around the breastplate and everything, but 
looking at it after, it's like, oh yeah. I like it. Granny Pig. Next time I'll be doing my thing black though, my thing. Uh... Oh yeah, we have the next time. <laughs> So yeah. Okay, back. She back. She been in on. <laughs> okay. She gone and been. Cafe <laughs> returned. Okay. I think I used up this black. Yay. Not in view. Okay, Jackson needs next. Can we find Smith? Yeah, like an hour ago. It was. Maybe you guys should make some popcorn or some kind of snack. Okay. Let's see. Give that a minute to um, dry. Yes, Jackson, dry. <laughs> There you go. Good job, honey bear. I gotta figure out what kind of gray I want to put on this. I'm in a gray, I think pearl black will be too black put over it. Maybe shimmering silver is too silver. I'll try shimming silver, maybe. We'll see. We will see. Oh, I didn't mix it. Not very good. Okay, let's mix it. I'm going to take the top off properly here. Talking. Huh. Open up the lid. Hopefully this one will mix good. Oh yeah, I should have done edging. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Why didn't I think of that? There's so many details I could have added to this. <sighs> it's kind of just going to be a flat piece. Dang it. Oh, please. Paint's mixing good. Mm, nope. It's not the 
mixing too much. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's pretty dry in there. Oh, boy. I don't know how this one's going to work. It's got a lot of moisture, but the paint part that separate is dry. Oh, don't know, don't know. Every time I put my is done, I can really hear it. It's like, oh no, sounds like a great big slam. How this is going to work. So, oh, it would have been so nice if I would have done more detail. <sighs> yeah, oops. Thought about it after. <laughs> well, I really should have put layers on each piece of material I added, like even the armor and stuff. I should have put. But, I mean, like I said, it'll be a lesson learned for next time, I guess. This is going to be a little plainer than what I want it to look like. This is not... Yeah, definitely could have used more layers. So that would have been just picking up on all the different textures if I added more texture. <sighs> oh, that's my glue and banging. Sorry, folks, I'm being a noisy person today. Noisy little crafter. <laughs> oh, I should, should have added more texture. I should have done at least a couple of layers of things on each piece of armor. Because then it would have really popped. Total regret.
Okay, for the first one, I guess it's okay. <laughs> oh, I'm giving myself a hard time here. <laughs> uh, no, there's no need to say. <laughs> I don't know. Looks fab, Eileen. You know it does. <laughs> But I wasted so much. It could have been so much better. Next time. <laughs> I could have added extra. Yeah, when you do something for the first time, I mean. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. I, looking at it now, I'm just like, ah, oh, why didn't I do that? Yeah. Okay. She's wondering how, how well she's going to stand on that. I suppose I've just got to use lots of glue. Like, <laughs> lots of glue. I'm to be brave and stand her up. Well, it's a very plain mm. armor, but... I just see all the potential I lost because I didn't add layers. Oh. She looks fab. Thank you. I don't think I can add any more. Um. Oh. Uh -oh. So pretty. <laughs> She's so pretty. So pretty. So pretty. So pretty. So pretty. So pretty. <laughs> gonna go around the bottom bit on this tip just because it will help strengthen it so around the bead I actually decided to do it on the uh, disc. Mm. Well, your so, dress is really poofy, so yeah, it suits it. Yeah, yeah. So it's, yeah, fits it perfectly. Yeah. Can you put her sideways so I can see it? Yeah, when I've just done this bit. <laughs> okay, sorry. I can't yeah. see. All I can see is down her, her dress. Yeah. <laughs> to be rude. <laughs> Oh. Mm. I have to put some poofy bits on down here just to... I love her wings yeah they're, they're the small ones because the angel wings didn't actually fit yeah, they're, on there they're flattening it was a longer dress yeah. skirt yeah because it's, yeah, it's all a poofed up skirt it's uh, Oh look! If I made armor, or if I made a weapon with it, it can lean on. Oh yeah. I was thinking yeah. That, um, I didn't want to add anything else to her, but there there's so much potential to add the arms, like the arm armor and stuff. But yeah, I might actually take my camera just up a little bit. So I'm just going to put you on screen on your own while I move my camera. Okay. Uh, oh, geez, she's not even in there. This is her. That's how she turns out. I, I'm so kicking myself that I didn't do the layers. 
like if you know what I'm talking about, right here I could have cut edges, like redid my face and cut my edges, add a little edge around everything. And that's why I'm kicking myself now because it's so flat. I mean, it looks pretty, but I could have done edges along the pattern, done them like dou doubled each pattern, even my belt. And that would have just really been top notch if I did that. So it looks really good. next time I'm going to make my patterns around everything. So then there's a little edge around everything. Looks really good. Because that would make it just that much better, I think. Because this is just like flat, shiny armor. No detail, no rivets, nothing sticking out. And if I'd done it the other way, I'm sure it would have looked so much better. That's what I'm thinking. You know, I'm not like, I like her, but I could see so much more potential. Mm -hmm. So... And I'm super glad I did her her top this way instead of like I did it two two pieces. Yeah, I really like the way it turned out. I was like, oh, I don't know how I was gonna do that, <laughs> but it turned out pretty good for that part. Yep. So here's mine then, just on the side yeah i love it yeah mm -hmm. she's got a bit of poof, poof on the skirt <laughs> and uh so very yeah, so very like yeah sort of like wispy and uh, whimsical i think <laughs> very pretty with it with a bit of glittery stuff on there as well mm -hmm. so i can't see the glitter Unfortunately, yeah, no, no, just on the sequins and that, yeah. Uh, and then I'm going to put some, some into the skirt as well. But I'll do that after because yeah. uh, just take a bit, and then uh, got to this has got to dry a little bit more firmly on there, and then uh, it'll be great. Stands up lovely on, on it. Yeah, they look great. Sure. So yeah, they two do. different styles, <laughs> which would really turn out cool. Both of them. Mm, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I have no idea why I'm in this mood lately, but I've been really into this medieval stuff lately. Yeah. So funny how we get into those little yeah. moods yeah. or whatever. Yeah. So there we go. That took, that didn't actually take too too long, did it? Because that was no. two hours and ten minutes. So a lot quicker than we thought we were going to be, <laughs> which is awesome. So yeah. Hi Joyce. Thanks. She says, "Ladies, these are cool." <laughs> and you. Michelle it looks fab. Thank you, Michelle. So there we, so there we go. And um, yeah. We shall uh, see you again. Pretty happy yeah. with. So thank you, Nikki, for torturing yeah. me. Because <laughs> it made me think about some. Take made me think about why well, don't I make this the way I wanted? So yeah, put your own spin on it. Yeah, exactly. Thanks, Michelle. So we're gonna, we're, yeah, we're going to go now, and we'll see you again uh, next Monday. Same bat time, same bat channel. Or Sunday for some of us. <laughs> also, yeah, your Sunday, my Monday. <laughs> yeah, okay. Thanks, Michelle. Thanks for being there all the way. Thanks, Joyce. Bye. Thanks for everybody who popped in and said hi. We appreciate it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> see, you. see you all again very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.